Mike Spangler. Nationwide is well known for its insurance products, but it also is big in the mutual fund industry. Runs about forty-two billion in assets. What trends are you seeing? Trends we're seeing are investors are distrustful of the financial institutions of the financial marketplace, and they really need some help. They really need some confidence, and we provide that to advisors and their clients by offering a broad array of mutual funds as well as asset allocation solutions. About 20 billion of our 42 billion is within an asset allocation solution. So we're trying to drive towards the objectives and the goals of investors to help them live in retirement and live well in retirement. Why do you think more investors are choosing target date funds? Do you think they're just giving up on trying to choose funds themselves? I think there's a lot of uncertainty, a lot of volatility out there. Uh, I think as a default in a 401k plan, target dates can do a very good job. We bring more institutional flavor to those solutions for investors. We offer them allocations to inflation indexing, commodities, global real estate, even emerging market debt that they might not be qualified or feel comfortable to make those decisions. And we help the advisor be smarter in that regard as well. What about cost? How do you compete with some of the larger players when it comes to the price of the target date funds that you offer? In January of 2012, Nationwide reduced our fees to our target date funds by about 34 percent. It was a competitive decision we made to offer better value to investors. I think investors are always thinking about the value they get from active and passive investment strategies. Well, you also recently launched a TIPS fund. Are you seeing a lot of demand for inflation-tied prod, uh, products? Are people worried about inflation from what you hear? I think inflation indexing is a great strategy to provide some anchor to the windward and to provide some good risk attributes and risk management attributes for investors. We don't see inflation yet. My own personal view is that if we're going to get to a stable recovery and get to some real economic growth, we're going to have to have some real inflation in the economy. And our, our product provides uh, a good solution in that regard. Any other new funds coming down the pike? What kind of demand are you seeing for different kind of products? It's a global world we live in. Emerging market equities, international equities are always on our radar. You'll see some product innovation and some product rollouts from us early next year in that regard. <laughs>